So you go from having this hard ass life, parents on drugs, in and out of foster homes, you know, trouble with the family. Amazing. My mindset was different from my normal team that's coming out of Baltimore. You know, I sing more, I done more, you know, so my mindset was it's ready for me to, you know, to take off, be better, bigger than other things. Put in work effort. They say when you get right upon them, it hurt better. All you gotta do is hit the switch and it work better. Yeah, they compared me to Mike Tyson and younger Floyd. <laughs> Tank Davis is going to be the biggest star in the entire sport. He's going to be the face of boxing. Ain't got to up it up, so I don't never tuck it out. So many funny moves in this bitch, I'm going to fuck you Some people made the door and some people just, you know, talk that way through it. You're putting everybody on notice. Everybody. The boxing realm has developed an uprising force. One of the biggest stars in the sport. People want to see him. They, they, they want to see him. He's that guy. Yeah. He has the it factor. I'd rather beat somebody up for 12 rounds than get the knockout, but uh, people like, like knockout, so. Baltimore native Gervonta Tank Davis has continued his domination at the pro level, becoming a five-time world champion winning titles in three divisions but still not recognized as one of the best fighters, pound for pound in boxing today. Gervonta Davis seems to pass the eyeball test in terms of displaying great physical skills like hand speed, punching power and overall athleticism. I've been here for so long, you know what I mean? It's time to, you know, grow up, become that young OG. Right now, the little situation that's going on with boxing, I feel as though they're sleeping on me, so it's time to wake them up. The only reason Tank is not the face of boxing right now is because the level of opponents is faced in the ring. Although some has been tough, none had the pedigree of an elite. The expectations are too early, but he hasn't reached that level yet, let's face it. However, if you ask any young fighter in the world to have Floyd Mayweather in his corner telling him, telling the world that you're the next great thing, what fighter would want that? The lightweight division for some time has had a few fighters with credible attributes or even pound for pound status but has not had the chance to face each other, slowing down the anticipation of fans' cravings for competitive fights and pay-per-view numbers for Tank. When you're at the top, there is always the ones that are hungry to take your spot. There is a looming rival, also a prospect to become one of the best in the sport. It's my era. King Ryan Garcia could potentially be one of the most popular in boxing, which makes this fight one of the biggest. I want to inspire as many people as I can. I will, I will not stop to the day I die to reach more and more people just to give them hope and to give them passion and to keep them something to fight for. How long for. you want to do that? Always. How long do you want to do that, though? Forever to the day I die. But I will fight Tank next. If Tank wants that uh, at 140, hey, but hey, hey, I'm going to record all the negotiations so, he, so you guys don't make no headlines saying I'm ducking. If he want it, let's get it. I don't know what they, listen, if you said that to my time, you'd be the next guy. Ryan Garcia, I'm knocking Tank out in two rounds. I truly believe I'm better than him. And I'm gonna take my place as the face of this incredible sport and bring a new generation of boxing fans with him. Two rounds? <laughs> That's crazy, that's crazy. Uh, Roly said the same thing. Roly said the same thing. Uh, 
I don't know. Yeah. I don't know what they, 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 they think. He made a bet with Earl Spencer he and he lost that bet. He did. You know what I mean? Tell him bet again. <laughs> <laughs> Tell him bet again. Why is that fight against Tank Davis so important to you? because that's gonna give me the respect I deserve. And I'm never afraid. I'm trying to tell you that I have a spirit of competition in me and you're gonna see that come out when I fight Tank. And, 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 and whoop his ass. The work is the truth. This is just all illusion right now. I'm ready to to offer you a multi 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 million dollar offer to fight Ryan Garcia. Um, you know we're we're ready and willing to to uh, split broadcasters, meaning we can f have this fight on a Showtime pay per view and the zone pay-per-view split everything down the middle let's make this fight happen everybody makes a shitload of money and uh and we give the fight fans what they want to see i'm used to people judging a book by its cover you know they look at me and they judge me right away then they see the fire come out of me when i'm in there as i said tank is more down the road um having been in there with more experienced guys. He knows how to take away the range. He knows how to close the gaps. He knows how to even get you to give up your hike. Unlike the last Garcia that Tank just beat, this Garcia is a is a good puncher. Tank Davis is that power guy. We got it. We got it. TNT. Um, Garcia can punch. He can punch, especially with that left hook, the counter left hook. All access, let me introduce it. Gervonta, three-time world champion. Davis! Incredible! And this fight is over! Floyd, is this the future of boxing? Absolutely. You know, Heyman and Mayweather promotion, they've done a great job with it. Great job with building it. Great job building the brand, okay? You got the brand now. The kid is a star. The kid sells out arenas. Now it's time to give him his career, you know? The Hall of Fame career. I'm right here on the soil right here. You know, the Hall of Fame ain't nothing but a few minutes away from here, you know? That's what that's what Tank should be thinking about, man. want to be remembered for the rest of his career. I mean, the money is great, you know? This man, go in there and fight somebody, bro. Fight somebody, fight somebody that we all know, somewhere where we don't know who's gonna win the fight. Take that risk, because yes, you are now. You now, you're now known. Everybody know you, the brand is built. But can we get the fights now? It'd be a heck of a fight. It would be a matter of, Garcia would have to control the outside. What the other Garcia the other night was trying to do. But he's got a better champ, he's got a longer champ, he's got faster hands got more power he's got something to make tank davis have to worry about a little bit to be a little more respectful of where when he's closing the gap he'd have to worry about the power of that left hook that's important he's got something to keep tank a little respectful in those areas a little bit you know mindful mindful in those areas and that's important they've been building towards a showdown for a while thanks to an outside the ring rival that's included verbal interactions on social media and an apparent physical altercation at a nightclub in which Garcia said Davis grabbed his chain before security intervened. I actually did see, uh, I seen Tank in the club. Oh, yeah, yeah. I did see him in the club. And uh, I went up to his table with me and this guy. And we said, uh, yo, are we gonna make this fight happen? And uh, I guess he got offended by that. Got all worked up, and I was like, yo, what you on about, man? It's like, ain't no respect here? And then he responds with, nah, there ain't no respect here. I said, oh, it's like that. Okay, it's like that. Okay, and then he tried to, he did, he, he grabbed my chain, but I wasn't worried about it. You know, there's so many security cards there. 
I knew he wasn't going to take my chain or do anything, really. He just wanted to seem tough. I want Ryan Garcia to knock his ass out. Knock him out. Sit him on his pants. Give him a rude awakening. Because I'm not a fan of Tank. I'll be honest with you. I'm not a fan of what he does and how the way he operates outside the ring. You know? Uh, he, he got high hopes, Ryan. Ryan had high hopes. Uh, we can't, we can't uh, overlook his, his his statement. You know what I mean? We just gotta be mindful of um, he's coming. You know what I mean? So I definitely gotta be prepared. And Young age, stage, long away from session age. Big way, he gonna have to get stage. People saying Ryan doesn't belong in the ring with Gervonta. This would assume that it wouldn't be a competitive fight. You can argue that Tank's last four fights has been competitive. Everyone has seemed to be competitive with him. If they can give Gervonta trouble, Ryan definitely will be competitive whether he wins or loses. Ryan is explosive, extremely fast, and Tank is going to have to contend with that. That's going to give Tank trouble early until he catches up. The question for Ryan Garcia is can he take a punch? I don't see nobody but me, who I'm gonna lose to. I can see me taking a lead over the new school. It's my mission to knock out Tank in two rounds. The Yankees turn in my city, they try me, I get it cracked. Used to people judging a book by its cover, you know, they look at me and they judge me right away. If they had the force, you can check, check me. Out.